Well, I'm back to my Victoria 2 Super Jeremy Assimilation Nation mod playthrough as it's 8, 1920 as of course I'm fighting Russia and Yuan and I'm supposed to have a Kazabelli, I have a Kazabelli on Liberia I haven't used yet and I'm getting a form of Kazabelli against France so I am very busy and of course I had to restart filming this because of bullshit that popped up real life. Up oh, there we go just like earlier. There we go. That's right, Russia. Accept your place as I took over part of China. Okay, that was not the part I wanted. I wanted this part. <sighs> Whatever. At least I got what I want. Now head over here. Man, that still fights. That's not what I wanted. I wanted all this right here. Much more populating all that. I already turned you to a state. Now, here's the problem, though. When I finished, when I was filming last time... After I took care of Russia, I then went to war with Liberia. And not only did America re-get involved into the war, but Russia got involved too, even though we're supposed to be at truce. And the war was honestly not going to be something that was going to probably be easy. Because all my forces are not ready to do that. So honestly, I'm going to have to do a lot of planning beforehand, or I might even just skip doing Liberia right now. Because I definitely could do France. That's pretty quick and easy. I could just quickly crush them. But I don't know if I could fight America, Russia, and Liberia. Especially since it's going to cost so much to take Liberia that I don't think um, going for it right now is worthy until I get, build up my strengths against the Americans, especially. Because Russia, as you can see, is not really a threat anymore. The Americans are definitely still a threat. Even when I weakened them earlier by breaking out um, New England and Deseret from them. They can still be a problem. So we'll see what happens. Maybe I'll attack Liberia. Maybe I'll wait a little bit longer. But I need to get more troops into America first. Alright, so with that rant out of the way. These troops are coming back over to get ready to attack France. Although I don't think that's going to be anytime soon actually. Let's see. Oh my god, it's going to be like almost the entire year still to go. Now, what about my Cosmo of Liberia? I'm pretty sure I have less than a year left. I got till November to use it. Well, if I can do plan ahead, that should be enough time to get ready. But that would not be necessarily smart to fight them and France at the same time. That could be a little bit problematic. I'm not exactly sure what to do, because I would like to take over Liberia, but I don't want to fight Russia, especially America, right now. Or at least all at once. Because they are not going to be easy. And then I have to deal with France, too, which is going to be an even another problem. So for France, I'm trying to take away Algiers. And the Congo right here, these are ugly exclaves that need to go. And... Take more of French, um, met, met, metropolitan France, since that's what the area is called, main, mainland European France. No Guanxi, no access for you. Sorry about that. Alright, now go for the next army tech. Want to max out all my army tech. That way I don't have to worry about being weaker than anyone. And also... Maybe in the meanwhile, I could probably reorganize my my um, forces in the Americas. That way, I can have a good defense against them too. If we do fight, like I could split up this stack and send it over here. You are not needed right there. No one can invade you right there. So go to Montreal. Let's see if I can just start reorganizing my entire American forces to be useful for when I do attack for Liberia. Alright, now... You're needed in Thunder Bay. And you're not actually needed, so you can go down here. You're also not needed right there. So, you can maybe go right here and we can split you all up as my Alienware had to turn off my Alienware earlier for s and restart because there was no sound for some reason. And then all of a sudden, when I finally when it comes back on, all of a sudden plays the error sound. So, it's good to know that the sound's working again. 
No, I don't need to put them there. That's not needed. Go right here. Alright, then I gotta deal with over here, because I got a couple promises right here that they can invade still. Oh my god, there's like four provinces they can invade me from, which isn't good. Problem is, I can't really, I can't fortify Alberta, because I can't reach over there. Close I can reach is from Deseret. I don't think they would give me access here, even though I... Even though I've um, misfeared them since they since I have so much infamy. Alright, let's see now. Okay, I can maybe do both wars at the same time. Maybe that's still very risky. Fighting Russia, France, America, all for Liberia. All right, a new stack is being built, looks like. Let's send you up here instead. No, go up here. We're going to start building up some forces on the Russian border. That way, when we do go to war of Russia again, we'll be ready. Come on. Let me go put the tariff back up. As I'm not making as much money like I used to, sadly... Alright, do this. Do that. Alright, we're now into July. They have so many troops I was building on screen too. From um earlier. I'm still trying to build them all. They take so damn long. Alright, there we go. Right there, hand up here. I might split them up. Russia got model colony, you motherfucker. Are you kidding me? Of course, I can't get since I don't have any colonies. Remember, I turned them all in the states. Not enough troops yet. All right. Still got a while to go. Because my industry is going up literally a point like every day. That's crazy. Because my Russia, my, remember my great global Russian Empire game? That's the only game I've done where I got over 10,000 points in industry alone. I wonder if I'm going to do that here. Because I'm getting close to, this is on the verge of not only being my, um, hot, this is on the verge of being my highest scoring game ever. And being only the second game to get 20,000 points. Hell, maybe if I play my cards right, maybe I can be pushing for 30, I mean 30,000. That's very ambitious. Very, very ambitious to get 30,000, but hey, you never know what could happen. Maybe I could somehow hit 30,000 before the end of the year. That would be awesome. I'm already near 20,000. I got 15 years to go, effectively. Alright. Here we go. Let's go take care of France really quickly. I want... I want mostly Algiers. For, I just want to take your colonies more than anything. Even though they're... States now instead of colonies. All right, there we go, France. All right, now, as for attacking someone, no, I'm not gonna attack Italy. I'm, I'm busy right now. Deal with all that. I don't think I'm gonna. Well, actually, Guan Xi has no army, so what could they really do, honestly? Maybe I will attack them. All right. Let's quickly invade France and get this out of the way. Let's just kill them. Die a quick death, France. I mean, I've already killed you enough in this game already. And I got till November 1st before I till I'm attack for Algeria. I mean, I'm Liberia. Oh, Dutch! Oh, okay! You want to get involved, huh? You want to tussle? Alrighty. I want to annex you so badly, but of course this isn't Hoi 4, where I can't do that at all. Yeah, there we go. Already invading them. Okay, let's kill your navy. Save my navy. There you go. Now your navy's going to be crushed. Uh, uh, I'm losing a bunch of ships for unknown reasons. There you go. Now start to turn around. My god, I'm losing a whole bunch of ships for no reason. 
Go down here. Oh god, my nose! Nothing like sneezing filming. How are we still losing to Germ- um, Oh god, now France is involved. Ain't that lovely. But even so, I have a much bigger navy than them. I should be crushing. Pause. Pause! Christ! Just pause! God! I need to check this map and shit. Alright, now we're gonna have to send this force down here to help out. No, you'll take too long. Go down here. Come over here. Alright, I think it's time risky time, but here we go. I'm gonna go take Liberia now. I really want to colonize that territory. And I gotta fight France, Russia, and America all at once. And also invade Holland, take over this so I get my tick. There we go! Russia and America now fight me at once. Ain't that just lovely? And the Netherlands, who are not a threat at all. Let's go kill their navy too while we're at it. God, this game is gonna take so damn long now. Thank God it's near the end of the year, but next year's episode is gonna take forever to do. All right, head up north. Split you up. You're gonna head out here. All right, northern France has fallen. All right, head down there. Alright, now head out here. Speaking of which, I need to pause because I need to forgot about checking out my Russian army on the border. Head up here. And then for America, as they're already invading through Alberta, I think it's time we start invading them myself. Let's go kill him right here. Mm. And send this force down here. Start invading America in the hundreds of thousands of men. And also, I forgot, I need to call an election so I can get more people. I can get more jingoism. now. There we go. Killed their navy. Yeah. Well, they're not willing to surrender yet. Plus, I don't want them to surrender because I want shit still. And also, you're heading down here. Help out. Alright, yeah, continue invading Algiers so I can get my tick. Ooh! Oh man, we be oh my god, we killed the Americans in a whole bunch of provinces I see. Wow. We keep going. Head down to New York. Man, what a big victory it was against America. Crushing. Look at that. We're beating multiple fronts and we're still winning. Start heading to Ute, um, Omaha. I mean, oh, not Omaha, Ohio. Alright, now. Head down here. Head over here. As of course, we still keep winning. Can't ever stop winning. 
Invade New York. That's crushing the French right there. Come on, Jingoism. Please pop up or I need to get the Jingoism crap. So just start appearing already. We all know damn well I'm winning this war. There's no way they're going to... France is giving up, but no, 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 France. I want more than that. I want your colonies. And preferably also a state in you too. Oh. Grand, that means, okay, Michigan. Head out here. Oh my dear God, they're going to throw everything in there to ensure that they win. America's desperate. And I mean desperate for a win. But guess what? I'm not going to give them a win. Because in fact, after you take care of that, head south. Continue to invade Minnesota and Wisconsin. Go. Now invading the Green Bay. No! I need jingoism! Give me jingoism! Damn it, I hate when the game does that. Should be so obvious, just give me some jingoism, they still stubbornly refuse to do so. Alright, head down here. Head down here. Head down here. Alright, head down here as well. Alright, New York City itself has fallen. Or at least, almost. That's actually not New York City. Manhattan is. Mm, my troops are barely holding on there. That's not good. Come on, Jingoism, please pop up already! So I can force France out and deal with the Americans and Russians. Alright, now head up to St. Petersburg. Deliver a very hard, decisive blow against Russia. Here in the end of the episode. Let them invade Canada like they could do anything about it. Alright, now head down. Oh my god, we're losing both areas now. Christ! No! That's not what I want! You already did the... Um, trade one. Stop giving me that. You just did that last time. Fucking game. Give me what I want. That's jingoism. Only give me that. Alright, now go fight them. Go up here, then go over here. Now that'll wrap up this episode as we are now in 1921. I was waiting for it to hurry up and unpause. There we go. Alright, so now will wrap up this episode as we continue to invade the Americas and France and Russia for Liberia and all that crap. So see you guys next time.